automate? So why automate? Why automate? Why automate? Why automate? We need to automate because there is a labor shortage in the market. The name of the game is how can I produce more parts in a short amount of time for less cost and higher quality. General impressions of the event were, were really great. It was amazing to see the Robobox and Core Logistics. Having those here makes a world of difference. I mean, every company can automate. Every company has to automate. Our strategy in regarding automation is really that we are automating everything around the cutting tool. And with Zoller, you can start small, setting up a single source database. We implemented the Zoller TMS. We wanted to make our business more efficient, but also because we wanted to prepare our students for industry when they graduate high school, when they go through any post-secondary education and end up in industry. We also featured our RoboSet 2, so we can fully automatically 24-7 cutting tool batches can be inspected. When the RoboSet was showcased, what really stood out to me was in making sure that the tools are good for the process that you're going to use them for. So you could check everything ahead of time and make sure that you're maximizing your tool productivity. All of my staff was already familiar, at least, with some level of, of automation. That and improving upon our automated abilities with the RoboSet allowed them to really have freed up time. And now with our new solution, Robobox, where we can automatically shrink fit a, a tool in a holder, fully automatic, independent of any user. This is an absolute game changer in the industry. One of the things I'm really excited about is the Robobox. So as we ramp up our new factories, we're going to have a large demand for heat shrink tools. We'll be able to take that labor and utilize it and hire more machinists or hire more programmers and still provide the same service. Now the Robobox will go on a roadshow. We will present it at some of our customers. We will present it at some of our partners. We will take an entire journey from the East Coast to the West Coast, also into Canada. It will then be ending up in September at the IMTS show. We want to hear about the challenges and our task is to find a correct solution for them. We've been working with Zoller and talking to them for 20 years. We're just having a great conversation, showing them what the issue is, and then often in real time getting a, a hot fix. So whatever we have presented uh, during our Automate Success event uh, in Arbor, Michigan, uh, can be also seen at the EMO show in Hanover in, in September. Whoever will see us at the EMO can really look forward to our next and future developments in regards to automation.